Hey, what's going on, you guys? Like you guys to the channel, it's your boy Big Dog back with another one take review. And today, hold up, and today I got one for Snowfall season five, episode six, which uh we gotta go get Franklin, and also because they're trapped by the guy from Jumanji, uh, and he's about to feed them to a tiger. <laughs> Bro, this has to like this has to be one of the weird this this is by far one of the weirdest scenes I've ever seen in Snowfall. But it also simultaneously is my least favorite scene I've ever seen in the show, period. Because to me this was just out of character for what this show is, okay? This show's about drug dealing and and somebody said in the comments, like, bro, I got some stories about like me and how the stuff me and my friend used to see walking around LA. That's cool, but to me the like just for what this show is, I didn't I didn't think this needed to be seen. You know what I'm saying? Or, or this this needed to happen. It just felt weird. The whole thing, the guy getting his leg bit uh bit off and everything just bleeding out. All of that stuff just felt completely out of pocket. They get out. They just so happened to run into the guys when they was about to jack a car. Those just so happened to be the same guys that was like trying to, you know, jack them earlier. But from there, I think it I I liked it. Okay, it was everything. Start going in a certain pace. Uh, even to even it, until they went back to the house and the tiger just happened to attack one of the guys. Nobody heard the tiger creeping up. I mean, but it is a tiger, so they 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 stealthy. That's pretty much like their their mo and everything. It's just it just felt so weird and out. Of, it felt cartoonish, and and that's one of the things I don't like when I'm watching like shows like this because Snowfall is always giving me. <laughs> Excuse me, Snowfall is always giving me though that like that like authentic feeling. And I just didn't like this. This just felt completely out of out of place and out of uh, 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 out of character for 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 what this show is. You know what I'm saying? So that part I, I wasn't really a fan of. And then we started getting into some other stuff. And this is where I think things just really started getting good. Um, and then and one we got Teddy dealing with uh, Prissa, uh, Parissa. I think that's her name. And Parissa freaky as hell. I'd nail Parissa to the cross, bro. I I don't know what it is about her and all her freaky antics and shit, but I, that shit just turned me on, bro. Teddy, he messed up, so he just pretty much out of commission. But we trying to find out who exactly is taking shots at Franklin. Um, v, I, for a second, I started thinking it was V. I'm like, man, V V seeming real suspicious right now. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 I'm like, I, maybe I'm tripping. You know what I'm maybe I'm not. But I'm like, V is feeling like real suspicious right now. So I didn't know whether to trust her or whether it's her doing some stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like behind Franklin back. But it comes to find out like, nah, it's not actually her. She's just trying to like get into a spot to where it's like she can, you know what I'm saying? She can be safe and, and, and shit. Because like, Sissy giving her advice like, hey, this is um this is the life that you're in. And like, it's going to, these, these this, this shit not going to stop happening. You know what I'm saying? So for, Franklin goes to like check his stash. She's like, man, what peaches at, bro? Nobody knows what peaches is at still to this day. So everybody's just like, okay, gotta be peaches, man. And peaches done stole five million dollars from Franklin because they're the only two people who knew about it. Jerome, he pissed off because it's like he the person who brought peaches into this, and so and, and like Lou just like, well, Franklin's that's Franklin's man. You should. I'm just like, man, but this your boy, like. Like, I let him slide because he you vouch for him. You know what I'm saying? So, that's why he's obviously mad about the whole situation. So, I was just like, I, I don't know exactly. Because Jerome, like, he, he, like he, he's legit taking it. Like, he's pissed off about it. So, he even beats up a guy. You know, because he's like, he questioning him. Like, bro, we, we in a situation. We got shot at. Like, we, we, we asking y'all questions. We trying to see who, like. Who in the hell in the world decides to take shots at us? You know, and I don't know how, like, they got, like, some disrespect for people. They got some very disrespect for people because hey, there's no way I'm going to be in that position where I'm in and I'm, like, you know, somebody going to, like, you going to disrespect me? You going to come at me? Nah, bro, we don't. I'm not I'm not going like that. You feel me? Because, like, Frank's a big dog. And then we hear about this guy, Kane, who just got out of, just got out the pen. But Kane been out a couple of months, so Kane – been hearing about some shit that was going on while he was in jail. His little brother Kev got shot. You know, uh, uh, Franklin, the one who took that shot at him. So he's just like, nah, I'm not finna, I'm finna, I'm not finna let this slide. It's war. It basically, and like, and Franklin tells him, like, yo, you know, we can wipe out everybody. And he's just like, man, do you see me hiding, little Nick? I'm just like, oh damn. 
Like, so they got to deal with that. They still also concerned about where Peach is at. It's like a lot of shit going on. So I, this that's the this this is the part of Snowfall like I like that I like I got in, in, in invested in because like the 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 beefs that you get in because you're a drug dealer. Just because Franklin's like top dog, that don't mean like that don't mean that people ain't gonna take shots at him. You know what I'm saying? That's just like a natural part of of, of the business of like being a drug dealer you feel me so i was just like yeah i actually like that somebody finally like you know trying them and like franklin's old um those, those skeletons in his closet are coming back to haunt him in a certain way so uh i like that and and like him and him having the conversation with v because like yo you really <laughs> you really you really try dipping you know like you really try to dip, and she like, man, it's this this shit difficult. Like people gonna be after us like forever, and the the biggest the biggest uh thing job her job is to protect the child. Like you know that's what that's what she feel. Um, another moment before I, before I end it, before I wrap this up, because I damn I got through it a lot quicker than I usually do. But um, one of the things is uh also also didn't know he would be inspired on at the first drop. So I think also was like kind of like, and his whole thing is about trust. He was he was talking about it. He was like I didn't trust you. I didn't think you were coming back and everything like that. And then even though I that, I thought they was like cool enough to where it was just like bro, I got you, I got your back. Like we in this shit like together. Like he Franklin looked out for him multiple times. You know what I'm saying? So that, that I, don't, I don't know about that, but um, also kind of feel like damn. So Teddy didn't Teddy didn't trust me either. I just been kind of like, kind of, I think also kind of feeling like, damn, he might have used me, and he dipped on me, and this guy just so happened to save me technically twice. So like, where, where my loyalties, where my loyalties need to lie at, you feel me? So I think stuff is about to get real, real shiesty. But what's crazy, I don't think that is going to, it's only four more episodes. I don't think that ends the season. I think, Everything is getting set up to the inevitable con- conclusion for the seventh and I think or sixth and final season because I think the next season will be the final season is Teddy versus Franklin. I think I think that's where we that's I think that's where all of this is heading, and we just have that this guy Kane is pretty much just a placeholder to like just set up more of that okay because I think I think that's obviously going to be like the how all of this ends and and. It ain't not gonna end well for a lot of people. What Peaches at? I still think Peaches got HIV, um, and, and is dying right now. Um, but that kind of makes me wonder why. I guess he thinking like, hell, since I'm finna die anyway, let me steal this money and go live. I'm about to go live. You feel me? That I think that's what Peaches' mindset is right now. It's like fucking. I'm about to die anyway. I'm finna go live. You feel me? So I think that's where it's at. But I, I don't know. Uh, I could be wrong, but I, in this situation, I actually think I'm right. You guys let me know what you thought, thought about this episode down in the comments. Hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching the video. Hope you guys stay safe. And I'll catch up with you guys later. Peace.